Sam Davis, the kick for the new boy Dyer, Rio Dyer! Hi, I'm Rio Dyer, winger for Dragons Rugby. say the one who got me started was my brother mainly so he's the one who got me the rugby I used to look up to him a lot and also or even Brian the Banner obviously when at the age I was probably a couple of years back used to see him on TV and some of the tries used to score being a person that I looked up to because of his speed and obviously I could be awesome. Probably the, I don't know, I don't know when it was, but the Derby day against Ospreys was we scored in the corner from Sam's cross, cross field kick. It was a big, big moment in the game, and obviously, I think I don't, I don't know. If it's just I can remember the day the crowd just going mental, and like, just couldn't hear anything else but the crowd, which was amazing. Probably that one again. I think the, obviously from a couple of years back, actually probably Bennett on. From my debut, I think I don't know how old I was, but I was young, and then coming against a team like that, it was probably physical. I was probably nervous, but to actually get out on the pitch and make my debut was amazing. It's a good question. Who's the best trainer? I say Keddy. He's just non-stop, relentless. He puts 100% in everything. So, probably Keddy on that one. I go with Maxi, Max, because uh, I know he, he loves his fashion. Sometimes it could be a little bit off, but yeah, Max. <laughs> well, this is Gachi, really. I think he chucks his playlist on. Some of the boys like it, some of the boys don't, but you see probably half of the boys with their headphones on. But I think I kind of enjoy it. Funny enough, there's a dark horse, Aki. You see, I can see him in the gym sometimes busting out all his moves. Doesn't really bust him out, it's a show, but I can, he's got some moves. Uh, who's the worst dancer? Well, not tell Davis. There's a video somewhere of him dancing, but I don't think that could be surface because I don't think anyone wants to see that. I have too many divas. Uh, Tav, only because he get he does get in the fluster when things don't go his way, like when the boys don't listen to him. So that's probably Tav. There's a few gamers, but they they, they think they're they're good, but they're actually they're around us, probably like Ashton, Rona, Rossa. They all think they're good, but they're they're around us. I say, I say Babos, to be fair, usually when we're at the table, he's always in the corner texting, don't know who he's texting, but he's just always on it and just doesn't want to speak to any of the boys usually, so Babos. He is a softy, but probably Muzz, Ross Moriarty, he's, he's probably a tough cookie, but he is a softy at that, really. Oh, uh, Will Tower, David Drakeford. Looks like Mark Drakeford. If you get like a, a side to side of Mark Drakeford and Will, you can actually see the resemblance of when he's going to grow up. Who takes the longest? Probably um, Coleman, Christian Coleman. Because he's just in the mirror doing his air, like freshening up. Don't know where he's off, but he just always freshens himself up after the game. So, probably uh, Coleman. 